At this point, I'd like to introduce an old friend of ours. I'm sure that there's little need for introduction, but I'll do a quick recap. Albert Einstein was born on March 14th, 1879, and was a German-born theoretical physicist. He developed the general theory of relativity, now considered one of the two pillars of modern physics. Of course, he is most known for his mass energy equivalence formula, E equals mc squared. There's a famous quote by Einstein that I'm sure you've heard. Everything in life is vibration. There's another physicist with a similar opinion of the world by the name of Nikola Tesla. Tesla was born on July 10th, 1856 in modern day Croatia. He was a Serbian American inventor, electrical and mechanical engineer, physicist and futurist most known for the design of the modern alternating current or AC electric supply system. He said that if you want to find the secrets of the universe, think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration. The interesting part is that Tesla would likely disapprove of the juxtaposition I just made. He was critical of Einstein's theory of relativity and he has even been quoted as saying that, I hold that space cannot be curved for the simple reason that it can have no properties. It might as well be said that God has properties. He has not, but only attributes, and these of our own making. Of properties we can only speak when dealing with matter filling the space. To say that in the presence of large bodies, space become curved is equivalent to saying that something can act upon nothing. I, for one, refuse to subscribe to such a view. That was Nikola Tesla's quote. Tesla claimed that he had developed his own physical principle regarding matter and energy. When he was 81, he noted in a letter that he had actually completed a dynamic theory of gravity that would once and for all put an end to idle speculation about curved space. Though he also noted that he had worked out all the details, his theory was never found in his writings. That remains an unsolved mystery. Unfortunately, there's no way of knowing what Tesla's theory was or if he actually had one. So despite the fact that both Einstein and Tesla were physicists, their disagreements force us to conclude that their views on the vibration and the world didn't just come from the studies and disciplines they were engaged in.